Hey guys, it's me, Lego Master 627, and today I am back with another Zoa's Up 2 updates video. So, yes, actually, this time you can hear my voice. Yeah, <laughs> as you probably saw in the last video, um, not the video profile one. And you might have actually noticed that I actually uploaded that one. And that was to make up for the fact that I did not have my voice in the video before that. Mainly due to the fact that, um, I forgot to turn my mic back on after I made the, um, code and pin video for Clubbing It Online, um, earlier today. So, um, because I did not have my voice for the, po for the um, code and pin video for that. Because obviously I never have my voice for the codes. Um, but then I forgot to turn on, turn on my mic, and that's where we are now. So, um, I turned it back on just now, and, yeah, here we are. Let's do this. Um, so yeah, guys, today, in the lab, as you obviously could have saw last night during the update video, we actually got in. And it's pretty awesome that we were able to get in. So, with that said, let's look around. So, as you guys can see, things look a little bit different than the last time you saw it. For one, there's no levers around here. Secondly, the campfire is out. Third... The pressure plates ain't here, and also this second campfire ain't here either. But yeah, also the pressure plates are gone too, and that means one thing. It's time to go on the quest in HQ Expedition, which, if you don't know, started last Thursday, and will be ending this Monday, April 1st, and will go on with the April Fool's Party, 2019. But that's on Monday. So, as you guys can see here, here are all the missions and all the days that we need to do this. So, yep, that's March 27th, aka yesterday. So, we're going to go through all four of these missions in this video. And after that, I'll be showing you guys some other awesome updates with the lab today. Now, if you're wondering why I've not uploaded for like seven hours, that's because I've been here at the lab all this time updating things just to show you guys some cool updates today. And that is why I've not uploaded for like seven hours. Just if you were curious. Yep, if, in case you were curious and thinking like where I've been for over seven hours, just know I have been right here at the lab updating. There you go. That's your answer in case you wanted to know where I was. Anyway, with all that out of the way, let's get into all four of these missions. And there will be two more locking one on the 29th, which is tomorrow. And then finally on the last day, the 31st, the final mission will unlock. So let's look at March 21st mission first. So it says, drain the waterfall in the base. Now, basically all these missions are basically located right over there in the base. You know, the one I showed you guys last February. Um, yep, that base over there. And, yeah. And that also explains why all this stuff's gone. Where, the, like, the fire's gone, the pressure plates, and the lights are all gone because they were all, um, took it away. So, we need to get them back. And, yeah. Let's do the first mission. Now, in order to do this, we need to go into game mode survival for the first one. Oh, right, I forgot the music turns off. Oh, but you want to know one thing I actually forgot to do? I forgot to get a bucket. I have to get a bucket first. Oh, yeah, and all this other stuff. Um, I was using earlier, so. Yeah, with that said, um, let's go back into survival mode. And let's go to the base. Now. You might wonder, what is this down here? Well, just telling you guys right now, it is no normal path. It is... A secret entrance! Yep, right down here to this beautiful little secret passageway. If you guys don't remember, last year in Operation Dome, we had to go through this way in order to get to the base because the dome was covering the whole lab. 
Now, of course, since not many of you were with me back then, I think like, uh, give or take, I think like 58 of you were a part of my channel last year. Um, when Operation Dome was going on back in last February. So, this is probably completely new for all the new viewers that have just joined me this whole week. So, yeah. Uh, anyway, other than that, we need to head right in here. Now, sadly, I don't have a pickaxe. Yeah, I actually do not even have a pickaxe. Uh, let's go back into creative for just a minute and just get a random pickaxe. And done. Okay, so for the rest of this, we'll be done in survival. Come on. Come on. What the heck? <laughs> Wouldn't let me in for a few minutes. So, the waterfall it was saying in the mission board was this. So what you need to do is drain this. Three, two, one. Hold on. We have to drain this very waterfall. Yep. Yep, we have to drain it. So now it should go down. Yep, it should go down now. Yep, it's going down. We're, we have successfully drained the waterfall. Just give it a minute and we should be good. Oh yeah, let me just move that for a second. <laughs> but yeah guys, we have drained the waterfall. And... Oh, well, technically we did drain the waterfall itself, so that counts. So mission one is complete, although not completely just yet. The reason why I say that is because we actually still have to do something with this water. You'd think I would have gotten water for nothing, right? No, we got this water for a reason. And that's what I'm going to show you guys right now, what we actually got this water for. Yep, where I'm going right now is exactly where, where and why I got this water. So, if you guys don't know why I got it, it's actually for right here. Yup, it's for right there. For the community tree. For this whole event. Yup, for this event, the community tree gets some water to help it grow a little more. And that's what the water was for. So we had to use the waterfalls. Um, we had to use the base's waterfall in order to um, get that to work. And basically in this whole event, I know we never did this back in 2016, but we basically had to steal stuff from Evil Sheet Leader's base to help get our camp back in order. And that's basically what was supposed to happen in 2016. Sadly, it never happened then, which is why it's happening right now. On to the next mission, mission two. And that is right here. So it says, defuse all fires in lockdown. So, now we need to head back there, of course, by using the one and only entrance. And actually, I'm probably gonna get another ladder right there. Um, one more piece of the ladder so I don't have to keep falling down. So I can only just use the ladder itself. Because one of those blocks doesn't even have a ladder on it. I'll do that later. But let's go back to the base and we're going to obviously keep this open. So yep, that's obviously drained. Now all we have to do is... Well, if I have any flint and steel, which I actually need some. There we go, we got some. We can just do this. And now, we have to defuse all the fires in this room, which is locked down. So, with that said, let's do this. Assuming I can even get up there. Okay, there we go. That's one. That's two. That's three. That's four. That's five. And the last one's up there. Hold on. 
<laughs> I have no idea what's going on with my mouse. But that's six. Okay, we have now diffused all six fires in lockdown. And I don't see any more around here, so we are good. So now that makes the room dark. And the reason I had to defuse all the fires is to get fire back for the campfire at the camp itself. So basically, we're basically stealing stuff from Evil Street Leader's base. Yeah. Let me just make this 100% clear. The reason why we're doing this is because it's payback from Evil Street Leader corrupting um it's basically payback from evil sheet leader corrupting our stuff aka um wait what was the last thing he did actually, i actually cannot even remember the last thing but it, it is payback for him destroying a lot of things here at the lab yep it's payback for him destroying a lot of things here at the lab and that's why we're stealing his stuff as payback. Woo! Yep, that's why we're doing it. We're stealing his stuff as payback. For him destroying a lot of things here at the lab. And now, we got our campfire back. Woo! So now that mission 2 is done, let's move on to mission 3. Which was on Legos Island's second anniversary day. So it says, steal two li... Steal two levers powering a machine. Now, when it says that, of course, there is a machine somewhere hidden in the base. Oh, and um, give me one second. I am actually going to put a ladder there. Yeah, that's better. Now, let's go back to survival. So, we need to steal two levers powering a machine. So, um, I know exactly where that is. So, let's do that really quick. Okay, finally the next song comes on. <laughs> but technically, we need to go through the vent system. That should only burn a little. And please tell me I'm not permanently on fire. Okay, good, I'm not. But guys, I know exactly where we have to go for this. Oh wait, the first one is, uh, well, that's actually for another mission. Um, get me out of this. Get me out of this stupid cage. So, the first lever we have to steal is quite literally right here. Come on, stop lagging. Hold on. Ah, I can't even do this. Okay, going to creative. There we go. <laughs> I needed to do that in order to stop it from burning. But please tell me we have a lever. Okay, I think we do have one. No, wait, whoa. we don't. We don't have a lever. Okay. Make that actually 100% true. There we go. Now we can go back in and actually do this. So the next thing we need to do is, well, break this. Now watch this. It's going to work either way. Now I know this might be weird, but I'm actually going to do it. But the second lever we need to steal is right here. Where is it? Where it? Where did it? Oh, right. I already got it. <laughs> but that's the second lever we needed to steal. So that's two levers that we needed to steal. And now that we got on all that, let's get out of here. Oh. Um. Let me get this out of here. Oh my god. 
Okay. And done. So now that we got um, all of that, let's get out of here. Because now we actually have to put these two levers on something very, very special. You might have also noticed the lights on the little uh, um, craft places are out. Uh, and the ones I'm talking about is that right there? Yep, I'm talking about these things, the little, um, the tent things. Yep, right here. Uh, you may have noticed that there's no lever on them. So that's what I'm here to do. I'm here to fix it. Now, if only I can get up there, actually. That one's easy. Boom! That's the first one. Although, technically, that would have gone on second. But who cares? I love doing it in random order. It makes it a lot more fun. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna have to build some blocks because I literally cannot even get up there. Okay. Uh, Aha, there we go. And boom! Complete. Alright, guys. So, mission free is complete. So, yeah, mission free is complete, guys. Yep. Now, mission four, which was yesterday on the 27th. This says, steal eight pressure plates. Hold on. Yep. Okay, okay, seriously. It actually says, steal eight pressure plates in the base. So... We have to go back there one more time. Yep, yeah, we have to go back there one more time. All right, so now we gotta steal some pressure plates. Let's do this. All right, that's two pressure plates, two out of eight. Let's continue, guys. Not again. Okay, go back in the crave, then go in survival. I, the reason why I'm going back in the crave is obviously to stop the fire. So we only need two more pressure plates. And that's the one right there, the one I was at earlier. Let's get that one. Yep, that's seven out of eight. So the final one is right here. And now we can get out of here once more. <sighs> Hold on. Um, actually, I think we can actually find another way out. Um, oh my God, if only I can move my mouse. Oh, come on. What the heck is going on with my mouse? No, wait, please don't. Oh my. Why is my mouse so dead today? No, like, seriously. It is dead today. <laughs> my mouse is. Okay. And finally, but not least, we have to put that back one more time. And close that off. 
So yeah, guys, finally but not least, we are finally done. We got eight pressure plates, but we ain't done yet. No, nope. we're not done yet. And the reason we're not done yet is, well, I'm actually going to keep this open because technically we have to come back tomorrow on the 29th to, uh, you know, come back there again and um, steal another thing. By the way, while you've been seeing these missions, haven't you seen like a few changes around here? Well, that's what I mentioned to you earlier. Have you noticed like a few changes around here while I've been doing these missions? So, of course we need to get a heavy pressure plate. So, these are obviously stone pressure plates, but we can change that. All we have to do is go down to the potion lab, go into the analyzer room, which is where we're going right now. We're heading into the potion lab. Now we go into the analyzer room. And now we must scan all these. Uh, why is, why is it not going? And should be done within seconds. Now we just have to turn this on. And voila! Should turn into heavy weighted pressure plates in just a few seconds. Watch. All right, they are now that. Man, I'm so glad we got this analyzer. That would have been so, like, Dumb if we never had it. Faint Thor, we've had it for so long, all these years that we've had this lab. So, now that we got eight pressure plates, let's go back into survival mode once more. Oh, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. We actually need to go back into creative one more time because how am I supposed to get back up? <laughs> but in actual seriousness, let's actually head back into survival one more time. Um, I know that was my mistake. So we need to place down five right here. And finally, but not least, assuming my mouse will actually work. What the heck is going on? Seriously, do I really need a new mouse soon? Probably, yeah. In fact, it was actually two, two years ago today I actually got this mouse that I'm actually using right now. Two years of having the same mouse. And I think it's now starting to not work anymore. But, um, anyway, uh, now we got all eight pressure plates back up in order. And, yeah, I think we're very close to getting our camp stuff back. So, yeah, now we can finally, but not least, finally go back into creative mode. And also... Let me fill up the water a little more. Oh my god, what the heck is going on today? With my mouse. Oh! Oh! Oh, dead. Yeah, this is bad. This is bad. This is really bad. There we go. Now we're up in order. So guys, now that we have gotten all of that out of the way, I think we can change this back to weather, to weather clear, right? Yep, that was the reason. Um. Oh, I almost forgot to light this one back up. <laughs> There we go. Now we're back fully. So guys, we have completed four out of six of the missions in, in um, HQ Expedition. I almost said Operation, but... We have completed four of the six missions um, of, uh, of HQ Expedition. I don't know why I keep saying Operation, but it mainly, mainly almost focuses on that. I almost forgot I also got to put torches back on these, I think. What do I? I think I do, but guys, now that we've gotten all of that out of the way, let me go show you guys some epic changes right around here in the lab. 
course, this is obviously a point of HK Expedition. What we've been doing this whole time. And yeah. So, guys, here's something you did not see last time. Nope, I finally brought it back. The Big Brother Series um, board here. So, let me read them to all of you so you can get an idea of what's coming next for the series. So it says Season 1, September 1st to October 7th. Now, please note in Furmost, Season 1 and Season 2 were in 2016. Seasons 3, 4, and 5 were in 2017. Season 6 was in 2018. And Season 7 is here in 2019. But let me read them again. Then Season 2 was October 17th to December 27th. And um, the first one was obviously by myself, LEGO Master 627. Because back then, during Season 1, Rose Crystal wasn't even a YouTuber yet. But after when season two began, she obviously was a YouTuber. Which this was by her the whole season because of the fact that I wasn't able to upload gaming videos for three months straight. So she had to do all the work. I know. Thank the Lord those days are over. Season three was January 1st to February 17th of 2017 by both me and Rose Crystal at the same time. Season 4 was from February 22nd to May 4th. Of course, by me and Rose Crystal once again. Then Season 5 was June 3rd to October 31st. Of course, by me and Rose Crystal once more. And Season 6, the season we never finish. As it says right there, January 23rd, 2018 to March 8th, 2019. It says, never finished with a sad face. Because it actually was sad that we never finished it. But honestly, I thought we would never finish it anyway. Then, Season 7. Coming April 10th, 2019. By a once again, me and Rose Crystal. Yes, did you guys hear that? April 10th. Release date for season seven, I think. I don't know. Uh, I, actually, fun fact: it wasn't me who came up with the um, day. It was actually Rose Crystal who decided to go for April tenth. So, yeah. Um, just want to just get that in warning. Rose Crystal actually came up with the day of April tenth. So, guys, I guess you'll be seeing season seven on April tenth. So. Be on the lookout for that. That's only like a few weeks away, so that's not long from now anyway. But there's actually more to it. If I go to the backyard, which, yes, that is right, guys. I actually got to, in the um, Big Brother backyard for the series. Woo! I finally got it in just today, March 28th. And it was actually the longest thing it took me to put in. No, not kidding, guys. Do you see how big this is? Yes. You guys see how big this is? You'll probably realize that it probably took me the longest time to ever put in today for an update. But that's not all. This says, Big Brother Season 7 is coming April 10th, 2019. Way shorter than Season 6. Better competition. Yep, better competitions. And we'll actually complete it this time. See you there by, of course, me and Rose Crystal. So yeah, you can expect all of that starting April 10th, Season 7. And yeah, guys, we are all ready to go for that. I got the backyard all set up right here. And we are pretty much all ready to go for that day. I honestly don't mind the wait because, well, let's honestly face it, we need to start thinking of like what stuff we need to do, and that could take a while. So I'm glad she chose that day because we need to think of what we're going to do there, actually, here in the season. So good on Rose Crystal for thinking of a good day in April because we actually need to think of what we're actually going to do in this season. And yeah, we will actually complete it. Of course, we have no idea when we're obviously going to end it. Because obviously, we need to wait till the actual season begins in order to know when to end it. But, um, what is the next update I have for you guys? I think there's at least one more update. 
Um, I didn't complete the UFO just yet. It still looks the same, but I'll complete that sometime later. Um, uh, what's the... I, I, I think there's, like, one more update I need to show you guys. Yeah, I think there's at least one more update. Uh, I'm just trying to look around for it. Nope, we were just here. <laughs> uh, guys, I swear there was one more update I needed to show you guys. Where is it? Or is that literally all I did? Guys, I think that's actually all I did. No, seriously, that can't be it. Oh, it's actually over here. So do you guys notice how different this looks now? Yeah, look how different this looks. But I can make that better. Watch. Hold on. Hold on. Any seconds? Oh! Okay. I think we got enough destruction today. Well, I did this all off camera. Like, how different can you guys see this? This too. Anyway, uh, let me know below like what you guys think of this. I actually did have to actually blow up most of this over here to actually get in the backyard. So, yeah. Hope you like what I did, guys. And guys, that's honestly actually it for all of today's lab updates. Mainly the, mo the main focus, honestly, was H2 Expedition for all the missions. And secondly, the Big Brother Season 7 preparations. There will be more preparations regarding that later on in the future as we get closer and closer to April 10th. But um, I think the actual construction for the season probably will be beginning probably on maybe like the third or something. I don't know. We'll have to see what happens. But yeah, guys, be ready for an awesome season in the next few weeks because it's going to be awesome. And it's definitely going to be awesome now that I have a lot of you here on this channel. Gun compared to last time. Secondly, uh, let me also just take off all this armor. But yeah, now that I have so many of you on this channel right now, um, I have like 389 of you. Um, it's going to be so much of a good season this time because... It's actually going to be even more worth it than I ever thought in any other point of time. Like, guys, you gotta realize how good this can get every time. Like, no, like, really. You gotta realize this stuff can get big every single time. And I actually am serious. Just telling you guys, this will probably be one of the best seasons in the whole series this whole time. And guys... Just be ready for an epic season. You will all love it in dear life. Anyway, guys, that is all for this video. Like and subscribe if you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you guys later for, I think, Club Penguin Rewritten. Ahem, that's if the April Fool's Party did come out. That's if it actually does come out today. Who knows? I'm going to go check probably right now <laughs> and see if it's up. If it isn't, then I'm going to think of another video. Um, but other than that, guys, goodbye.
complete.